This week I take a look at different ways of managing power. Ever have one of those mornings where you're in such a rush to get to work that you accidentally leave the iron on at home? Balkan's solution is to add a timer to your outlet. So you plug in your device, choose a time setting, and then hit the start button. This way, if you walk away and leave your curling iron or heater plugged in, the timer will automatically kick in and reduce that outlet to zero electricity. And you know what? It works just like that. Now, Belkin wants to do the same trick for your television. They've got this power bar called the Conserve Smart AV. And as you can see, there's a color-coded system here. The idea is that you take your television and you connect it to the green outlet. And then you take all the other devices that are connected to your television, your DVD players, your video game systems, your cable or satellite boxes, and you connect them to the remaining ports. And what happens is, at the end of the night, when you power off your television, it senses the loss of power from your TV and then removes power to all the other components that are connected. You know, the ones we tend to forget about at the end of the night. Now, not all electronics like a sudden loss of power. A computer, a laptop, a hard drive, these are devices that when they lose power can become damaged or even lose important files. And so Belkin has added two extra outlets that act as normal outlets, will always provide juice just for those kinds of devices in case you have them in the living room. A couple of things I don't like about this particular product is the rather short cable length and the way that all the outlets are packed so that large brick adapters end up taking two different spots. But then, this is the thing to keep in mind. This is a product designed for your home theater, for your living room only. It's most certainly not designed for your computer study. Well, you can see right away why they're called squids. They have these long, grounded electrical tentacles, which are perfect for plugging in these large brick-like AC adapters that a lot of computers have. This is a surge-protected power system, of course, and you can get them rated for different levels. The basic black is good for most casual users, while the calamari white is rated at 3,240 joules for power users. But other pluses I like is the extra, extra long cable that comes with it, and a plug that goes flush into the wall and has a swivel design. Now these aren't going to save you power and money the way that the Belkin products do, but they do save up on clutter. I was able to replace two power bars with just one power squid, and for the first time, I can actually see my carpet under the desk. Inside a car, your source of power is the lighter port. Now, of course, very few people actually have lighters. A uh, few people smoke. So one company, Spotlight, decided to come up with a replacement. This is a rechargeable LED flashlight. You just put it into your lighter port, leave it there, let it charge, and when it's done and ready, you can pull it out. You get a nice high-intensity LED light, good for about three hours, shines out to about 150 feet. Now, what's inside my pocket? Why, it's the... E-Gear Jolt. Same idea, it's a rechargeable LED flashlight, except this one has a nice little emergency flashy mode, and it uses my favorite source of power, which is USB. How's that for a bright idea?